Hi everyone and welcome back to our weekly cooking vlog. Today we're just going to make um, a vegetarian ragu. We've decided that we're going to try and eat at least one meal a week, completely vegetarian, um, just because we want to really, basically. I mean look at it, it really does sort of scream out to you, nice and healthy, eat me and all these lovely colours and anyway. The only downside, I'm going to chuck some red wine in it, but never mind. So, it's dead simple. Uh, I've got my pan with a bit of oil in it heating up. Uh, I'm just going to fry off some onion. I'm going to make this quite chunky actually. You know, nice big chunks of onion, big chunky veg. So that I'm using a red onion. Uh, you can use white onion if you want, it doesn't matter. I just had these three left over, so I thought I'd just try and use them up. There's no hiding them from the kids this week, is it? Look at the size of them. Anyway, we'll see what they say. So in there, I've got my onion. I've just washed some celery, so I'll uh, chop that up nice and chunky. Basically, you're just starting them off cooking. You don't want them browning or anything like that if you can help it. Turn it down a little bit. Same with the carrots. I just love these recipes where you just chuck everything in. Makes life so much easier. Okay, so just in here I have got the onion, the celery and the carrot. I'm just frying them off a little bit, just to get the flavour out and get them going. And in mine I'm going to put some courgette and some mushrooms. So just whilst they're frying away, I'll chop up the other stuff ready. Right, so that's coming along nicely. I'm just going to add some uh, garlic to it as well. That can go in. Right, I'll just give that another minute and then I'll add the mushrooms and the courgette. So, mushrooms and courgettes going in. Uh, the onions or the garlic is getting a bit strong. Okay, so in there we have got the onion, courgette, carrot, Mushrooms, garlic, and celery. And probably from start to finish, that's probably about five minutes. Maybe a little bit longer, maybe six, six minutes at the most. So that's ready to go now. So I'm just going to add a red wine. It's probably a good half a bottle that, that's gone in there. Okay, so that's been bubbling away now for a couple of minutes with the red wine in it. I've just put two of those uh, vegetable stock pot things in it as well. So they've just melted down. Now, all we need to add is our chopped tomatoes. A bit of tomato puree, pepper, and some oregano. And that is it. Oh, 
good square to the old Tommy paste. I'll put a third tin in. That looks so good and so healthy. I'll show you what it looks like. How nice does that look? Okay, so that is everything in. Tell you what, actually, what we need in. Just a little bit of sugar, like a teaspoonful, that's all. Just to take the sharpness of the tomatoes off. Uh, and that's it. So all I'm doing now, I'll just leave that with a lid on it. Bubbling away for probably 10-15 minutes. And in the meantime, I've got a pan of boiling water. Which I'll just add the pasta to. So by the time the pasta's cooked, this will be ready and it'd be time to serve it up. If you're doing um, a pasta dish with big chunky veg like that, you need big chunky pasta. And if you're doing one with like a smooth sauce, use the smaller pasta. Okay, so that's it. That's gonna take 10, 15 minutes at the most, by which time this will be ready and it'll be time to serve up. Okay, doke, so that's it. Everything is cooked, the pasta's cooked. I've just got that to drain and then we're done. Pasta's drained. Basically now you just get your sauce over the top. Get a mix through. There we go. Done. And uh, we'll just dish them up. Maybe just a little bit of parmesan on the top. And that is it folks. All done. That looks so tasty. Look, it just looks, look at me, I am so healthy, come and eat me. So that's it for this week's cooking vlog. Um, I hope you enjoy yours when you get round to making it. I'm just gonna shout all the troops in and uh, get dinner served. Okay, thanks very much for watching again and we'll see you next week.